Hi everyone, today I'm going to kick off with a new project. It should be pretty short actually. Uh, it's a project looking at the Gartner BI Magic Quadrant, which some of you will have seen. Uh, and whenever I look at this, I think that I like it, but I always then want to think about what the previous year was and what year previous to that was. So just looking at this um, in a slightly bigger format, um, you can see that you have, this is in 2014, um, so you can see where Tableau was and you can see where uh, Alteryx is and Microsoft and Click and so on. So, the I however, the idea is I want to kind of express this over time. And now, I have already built a Power BI report and in that Power BI report, I have got the same sort of thing going on, but with only two um, two providers. In actual fact, I don't have 2014 at all. But the idea is that you'll be able to um, kind of use the play axis to look at all of the uh, look at all of the players. Now, to be fair, I don't plan on doing all the players because that would just drive me mad. But what I would like to do is have a better way of getting this data in. Because to be honest, I just got you know it it was frustrating putting this information in, and because I do power up, so I'm going to do a power up. So um, that sort of perhaps sets the scene. So now I'm going to move back to PowerPoint, and I'm going to escape off this, and this is going to be this is my wireframe here. So what I want to have is I'm going to have the image appear here. And I am going to have a, what should I insert? Um, well, I could insert a table, but I don't think I will. All I'm trying to, try, trying to do is put in some placeholders here. So I am going to have a, yeah, pick this, put this, um, we're going to have a, a table in here. And in that table, we are going to put certain bits of information. Believe me, we'll get there in the end. Um, so I am now going to do a couple of in more inserts. So um, I'm going to do a submit button. Yeah, something like that. Yeah, and we'll just go with a bit of text in there. Submit. And we, we only have a few fields. There's, there are really not really many fields at all. We've only got completeness division, date, ability to execute and provider. And so what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to sort of express this on the on the board here. To be fair, it's such a simple project that, you know, it really isn't going to take um, long for us to, to kind of flesh out. So all I'm going to do is uh, express the fact that I've got a few fields that I need to put in and that. Now, there's only one here that, that with the with the date field, so date, I'm going to put year, keep that simple, drop down. And essentially when the, when the year drop down is selected, I want the image over here to change. And then when I submit it, I want this to submit to a SharePoint list. So... Uh, and then I want the Power BI report to view the SharePoint list and then everyone will be happy. So that is the wireframe. I'm going to leave it at that for the moment and we will uh, we'll start again on the project um, in the next video. Thanks everyone.